All right. Okay. It is early in the morning, but I'm up and want to get some of my recordings done. So here I am. Welcome to The Sims for ABC Challenge Part 26. Uh, we've made it quite a long way. Corey, our founder, is now an elder. We have very limited time left with her. Her husband, Morgan, is also an elder now. The next birthday coming up is Ashley, so let's see when that is. Right here, Ashley's having a birthday in one, two, three days. So we're going to prepare for that because then Ashley becomes our uh, founder for Generation B. And we're going to, oh, oh. Before, uh, well, actually, I can't start the game. But just to let you know, the polls came in from Twitter. And we're going to send Ashley to college. All right. Um, she's still meanie. But Ashley is going to go to college. Um, I think there's something we looked into last game it had popped up up here in the notifications box there it is Ashley should be thinking about further education take a look at her options researching universities below or even on the computer so I think I'll have her do that after she eats I guess it's research oh, somebody's calling Corey they're not calling her anymore Dad is in here on Ashley's laptop. He should really come. Some leftovers himself. Once she's done eating and before she goes to bed, we'll have her research some colleges since this means Ashley's going to college. Now, the thing is, as long as the challenge is running, Ashley cannot, um, she cannot leave this lot as far as living is concerned she can't leave the lot so let's see university research universities so we're gonna research them both she can't move from this lot she can go to school from here but that's pretty much it I think those are the only things we have to worry about that she can't like move on campus she has to stay here okay research Ashley is we're gonna go with something that goes with her uh, wanting to be a painter. See what she found out that she's over there talking to herself. Come on, Ashley. Alright. So the Foxbury Institute. Let's see. Foxbury Institute consistently rated as a primary university. Foxbury Institute boasts modern campus and impressive facilities. With a broad swath of Illuminati, oh, not Illuminati, alumni who have emerged as innovative leaders in their respective fields. The university is always looking for students who dare to dream big. Okay, so we got organizations, we got the Spirit Squad, the Brainiacs, and the Bot Savats. Uh, we got degrees in art history, uh, let's see, communications, culinary arts, drama, they got fine art, history, and language and literature. And then their degrees are, well, these look like they're, I will say, like maybe bachelor's degrees. These might be they're like master degrees in biology, computer science, economics, psychology, and villainy. So, so far, what we're looking for for Ashley is probably fine art. It's between fine art and art history. So, let's check out, wait a minute, Ashley. Let's check out the other university. And see what what it says for the other one. Mom and Dad are just back there having them a nice breakfast, talking to each other. Okay, University of Wrightchester. 
The University of Rochester holds nearly a millennium of history within its traditional halls of learning. Having taught every type of student from royal to unknown, the university prides itself on educating both minds and morals, molding students who, who molding students into well-rounded, upstanding citizens, ready to enter the world and make a difference. So we got the organizations of the Bright Corps, the Art Society, and the Debate Guild. Ooh, we have an art society here. The degrees are in biology, computer science, economics, physics, psychology, and villainy. But they have those distinguished master degrees. Yeah, masters. In art, history, communications, culinary arts, drama, fine art, history, and literature. So I think we're going to go with the University of Brightchester for her. Because then if fine art is what she takes or if art history is what we choose, then we're going to definitely have her um, go to the University of Brightchester. So now, Ashley, you can definitely go to sleep. Because you're having a fit. You want to go to sleep. Um, he's still eating. I guess mom was reading a book, but she is also on her way to bed. Dad was sitting there having him a nice little meal. I wanted him to come outside and kind of look over his plants. I don't think anything need watering because they look kind of like he can evolve them, but they looked kind of bad. I thought they could have used some watering. I guess not. It's just that it's fall and some of these plants are definitely going to just bite it because it'll be to uh, cold outside. Oh, so dad's gonna go to bed too. Everybody's gonna go to sleep. Why did you wake up, Missy? Oh, you need a shower. That's something I'm pretty sure- oh, whoa. That's something I'm pretty sure we can also work on. Because I said a couple of things I wanted to do as far as working on building the house up. On, I put notes. Um, I did finally create that front patio, but I also said they needed a pool, they needed to expand the bathroom and have another bathroom, uh, a laundry room, and an upstairs. So I definitely want to, like, she's taking a shower. I definitely want to put another bathroom around here somewhere. Maybe off to this side, like coming out of the kitchen, because that could be like expanded to be a master bathroom for that room. Eh, or I could, no, I got the living room kind of set the way I want it. I could expand the kitchen if needed. She's sleeping right now, uh, Dinah. So I guess I'm gonna I'm gonna build a little bit. While I'm sitting here talking about it, I'm just gonna build a little bit. So, we got our little front porchy area here, and it's pretty long. So, we could put some little chairs out here. The outdoors. Yeah, like some outdoor chairs, like right up here in the front would be nice. Mm, not like loungy chairs. Let's see. Do 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 do. What would be some nice little chairs to go out front? Oh, these look nice. Like so just a couple of nice chairs. If you you can come out here and sit on the front porch. And what else? Did I see a little table? Oh no. No, no, no. That will go in the back. I thought I saw like a little table. I did. Like a tiny little table right there that they could sit stuff on. Let me see. Wall decorations, garbage this. We have some outdoor lights. These are probably huge. No, they're little. Okay. Um, I would just say like on the wall here maybe like right there give me another one like right in between these two chairs over there and 
I kind of want to put like a flower or something out. Let me go look for some other decorations. Yeah, like a plant. It says it's an indoor plant, but whatever. I'm going to put it outside. Let's see. I don't want anything that sits up on its own. Oh, yeah, like that. Nice little plant sitting there. Thinking about maybe putting one right here. Oh, that's small. Yeah, I can't put it outside. Of course not. But there was hoping to be able to put it outside. Um, let's see. Straw man. You don't do anything, straw man. Oh, okay. Mm. That's a kid's cooler. Cool kid's cooler. Oh, these are nice. Some wind chimes. Yeah, nice wind chimes. What's this? It is a bee box. Maybe in the back. Flower arranging. Mega cooler. It's a bird feeder. Hmm. No, I didn't realize I had so much stuff. This goes to show you how often I'm actually a patio warming lamp. This shows actually, yeah, let's put this up here. Wait, can't? In the corner? No, no, no. Nah, it looks weird. Come and get it. Street store. A magic. Plant sim stump. Hmm. Okay. So I think that's it for out here that I'm going to do. I don't really see anything else uh, that I kind of want to do here. I want to see if I can't possibly expand over here. Out like expand and I guess come around a bit. Let me zoom out some. Um, how do I want to do this? How do I want to do this? Okay, we might have to move his garden over as usual. I keep moving. Uh oh. I keep moving this garden around. Okay, let's see. Uh, I could bring it, make the kitchen bigger. And then have like a little, like hallway type thing. I would like them to have a bigger kitchen. Okay, so that's what we're gonna do. We're going to build, make the kitchen bigger, build a hallway. So there's a secondary bathroom back here in the back area. So we need walls. Walls and empty rooms. Walls and empty rooms. So we are going to bring this across to expand our kitchen. And then, let me see. The kitchen is gonna lead out this way should take us to like a, a small kind of hallway there and then we can um, have an extra bathroom like, it doesn't have to be too big and we can definitely stretch this well we can't do much with her in it. Make it maybe a little bigger, the bathroom over here. Yep, just connect them, I guess. Connect the two walls. Okay. Alright, so we got the rooms built here. Now we're gonna have to delete um, walls. How do I delete walls? I don't remember. Gotta delete walls. Not holding this anymore. 
I guess... Bulldoze? Is the wall gone? Wait a minute. Bulldoze terrain, bulldoze lot. I don't want that wall there. Okay. Okay, anyway. Get rid of this window. Well, actually, don't get rid of it. Just stick it over here. And I want this wall gone. Place wall, half wall. Okay, wait. Move wall. Yay! Your girl figured it out. Okay. No, oh, no, don't remove the floor. Okay. So now we have a way to expand our kitchen here. But we also need an archway. I see doors. Okay. Or oh, wait, where's the archway? This is columns. This one just now. I might have to search. Because things have been moved around. Ah, there they are. Uh, I think this would be a nice little archway leading out there. So now I know where my line is for my kitchen. And we're gonna actually upgrade the we're going to upgrade the kitchen. So we're gonna zoom in a bit. Okay, the flooring, I... Acceptable floor tile, you know? We're gonna get some nicer flooring. Want tile for the kitchen? Oh, I really like some of these. Cool. Let's see. I do like the acceptable floor tile. This one is really nice. Okay, let's look at it. Yes. Okay, so we got new floor tile in our kitchen. Um, what about the walls? Oh, that looks... Eh, I like how this looks. Let's see. So we have something that actually matches what's on the floor. Let's see. Not really. Let's see how this looks with it. Oh, I like that. Okay, I'm gonna leave it like that. Down. So we got new walls. Oh, wait. One of the things I hate the most is me forgetting to have done the outside of the house. <laughs> so let me make sure I get the outside. Okay. Make sure the outside of the house is done. Alright. Okay, so now we go into the furniture state stage. We can expand all of this across. So we're kind of going to get rid of this. Get that. Uh oh, I hit a button. Get out of here, Steam. Okay. That was my fault. Ah, Steam popped back up again. Steam. Not now. You're freezing everything, Steam. <sighs> okay. Just gotta leave it there because it's really bothering me. Uh, we might change these. I think I will. I'm updating, so I'm gonna get rid of a lot of stuff. Wait a minute. There we go. Steam out of here. Pick 
all their leftovers are gonna disappear because I did that. Okay, I want to keep the ceiling lights. I do like them. I think these are like my favorite ceiling lights in the game. I want to keep the ceiling lights. Um, now let's go to the kitchen. Definitely need some more counts, new counters. So I think these were the ones I had last time. Mm -mm -mm. I like the these right here. So we're gonna get a bunch of these counters. Like just come across with it. We'll delete whatever we don't want. No! How? Why? Why did this happen? They're gonna be able to have a lot of appliances now. One there. Okay. Uh, so we have counters. Now our stove, I would much, much like a updated stove. I think this is the stove we had. Um, I might change the flooring. It, it really clashes with that brown. Throwback stove. Classic modern stove. Maybe silver. Did get it? I say right here. That back there. I'm changing the flooring. It looks so bad. I gotta change it to something different. I think it's gonna be two different shades of brown. What about this one? That's a little better. It goes better with the brown, at least. The other one was like, ugh. Couldn't stand looking at it. Okay. So we got that. Um, let's do some kitchen appliances. Something that they have not been able to have. So, I would like them to actually own a dishwasher now, so we're gonna put that off to the side. Mm, let's see, they have, there's espresso machines. Let's get them a popcorn popper, because they do watch, they tend to watch a lot of movies. Um, I would like for them to have a coffee maker and a tea maker, actually. So, let's get them a nice coffee machine over here. And that kind of goes with the room. They have the tea. Yes. The tea brewer. A microwave. And... Oh yeah, I gotta put the fridge over here. I'm just sitting stuff all over the counters. And this. Ice cream maker. Why not? So we need a, um, we got a garbage. I'm satisfied with this little garbage. We're gonna come and stick it in the corner. <clears throat> Let me see. Refrigerator, there's no fridge. Um, where do I want it? I guess, no. Okay, fridge. Look at this nice classic modern fridge. Get it a, yes, that's nice. Okay, sit it right there. Uh, it's a little lighter than the rest of the stuff, but okay, it's all right. It is quite all right. So, can we get some little like kitchen decorations to go in the kitchen? Let's see. Uh, basketball? Goodness, why are we doing that? 
Red box of holding. Aww. Red box. What else we get? Oh, where's the tea teapot at? Oh. They got teas, they got teapot, that's cute. Oh, let's see. A rack of wood of dishes. Okay, I actually think now it makes me want to move the ice cream maker over. Yeah, leave it there. And put the dishes right here with the. That. Actually, they have a dishwasher. Uh oh. So they wouldn't need this. Makes more sense. Paper towel holder. Uh, medical? No. That would be something good to put in a laundry room. Let's see what else we can decorate with in here. Ooh, another big decorator. Let's see what else we have. Hmm. I see a lot of presents. Restaurant menu stand. A utensil holder. Can I sit it anywhere? Uh, can I get it in a different color? Yeah. Back here in the corner. Yeah. Utensil holder. Uh oh. Went too far. Went too far. Let me see. Mary Milkmaid. Those are kind of cute. Postcard corkboard. Okay, let's see. What's this? Bowling ball rack, paint cans. Now, it would be really great if this stuff was distinguished by, you know. Oh, that's cute. By room. Because you click on the kitchen and you would hope that they would have decorations for the kitchen. Like kitchen decorations. These are just all of the decorations. And I kind of got to look at it and see if it's anything I would want to put in the kitchen for decorative purposes. That's an amp stack. Here, a bowl of fruit. Are these, yes, like sauces? Like different kinds of sauces. Yep, yep, yep. Gotta have our, our condiments. Different kinds of sauces. This. Oh, gas, gas is gas. Grandmother's urn. Uh, that prop signage. An antique coffee pot. No. Definitely wouldn't have that. A honeycomb bottle holder. That's pretty cool. I wonder if they have a mod for that. I'm definitely going to check it out. Maybe in my own, like, personal game. Might start taking some pictures of my personal game and showing them off. Okay, so I've decorated this kitchen. I've made it exponentially bigger. Um, zoom out a little. I think I want to get rid of the chairs or maybe change chairs. Because there's only the three of them for now, still. There's no, um, I don't know how many kids Ashley will have in her sim lifetime. So, I'm gonna get rid of all of it. Alright, let's go look for a table and chairs. That's the wrong room. We're just gonna upgrade the table. Just, we're not gonna do anything super fancy. This one? Yeah. And get some, grab some chairs for it. Mm. This, 
This actually looks like a comfortable chair. Comfort one. Comfort one. Oh man. These don't even have a comfort, so definitely get one with a comfort of one at least. Okay, well I, I like this chair and it kinda goes with the whole brown theme I got going on here. I think I should move it over. I might have to put it back where it was. The table. Why won't these chairs get close? Hold on. See that? Maybe they'll move in when the... starts, I guess. Ah, uh, you know what? We're gonna undo all this with the chairs. And put our old chairs and table back. <laughs> okay. So the kitchen is done. Um, now we gotta finish the walkway back here into the secondary bathroom. And then expand that bathroom. I might have to wait a little bit, but I have everything done. So I want this. Uh oh, I kind of want this this to be hardwood right up in here. Um, this is nice. This is nice right here. And we're going to. Try to get like some kind of just a neutral, nothing special kind of wall paint. Something, yeah, that just kind of goes with the floor. The nothing special paint. Kind of dark in this hallway, so we're definitely gonna need some lights. Um, my favorite. Let's make it brown. Yep. I know the special lighting. Alright, so this is the secondary uh, bathroom for anybody coming by, coming over. Um, decorations cost a lot, I see. So now we need some windows uh, for this room page up. Uh, I put that window over there. Let's see. Just cover them up with curtains. And... I'll come back to the roof. Alright, so we need a door. Right here. I think I've just been using like plain doors. Yep, that's the door I've been using. Okay. Um, what did I use in here? I used those. Oh. I'm just gonna go to the bathroom and get- oh. We're just gonna go to the bathroom. It has no flooring in here. Um, so let's do something like really Again, really simple. This is for wooden people. This is the extra bathroom for the house. Uh, we need 
some tile on the walls. I say we just make it kind of match the floor a little bit. Alright, so we go to the bathroom now. So let's see. Obviously, we need a toilet. Raw toilet. The John. I'm gonna go with the raw toilet. And of course, we want a sink. Nice sink. This one, the raw, the raw sink. Get white. Everything over here is gonna be kind of white. Okay, a mirror to go over the sink. Yeah. No. Okay. And let's see. I would like a tub shower in here because that's what I'm going to put over. Actually, over there, I'm going to put a tub and a shower. But over here, we're going to leave it as the tub shower combo. Oh, uh, wow. Yeah, we're going to do the tub shower combo on this side of the house. And let's see. Have a nice kind of rug. No dogs, no cats, mat, no. What about this one? Not this one. Maybe right in front of the tub would be cool for that. Let me get another one. You know how the floor is cold when you come in the bathroom? And you put your feet in front of the toilet? It's like super cold right there. Okay, for one thing, we don't have any lighting in here. Um... I, I, well actually, let's see, let's see what they got as far as the lighting on the wall here. Uh, I kind of like it when it has more lighting in the bathroom. This is why I like overhead lights, because... In the game, it gives it, like, a great view. Like that. You, you can see everything. And that's really the point for me. I want to be able to see stuff. So, let's see. What can we put in here? Not much, because everything is kind of like... We could put a couple of towels. Like, some towels. Um... Oh uh, yeah, the toilet paper holder. Oh no, not. Can't see it. Hold on. Who would get toilet paper from way up there? Like in all honesty, look at that. It must come down a great deal. <laughs> okay, game. Playing, playing all the games with me. I could if I wanted to, but I want to make a... I, if I was to really think about it, I could have put the laundry right here. But what I think I'm going to do... I might put the laundry basket there. I'm not sure. Oh look, a towel storage rack. Can I actually put towel on it? Nope. And I kind of don't want it there. Now I can't see it. Yeah, give me that. Yeah, I can't actually put towels on it. That's the point. Okay, anything else? See? Like, I thought it would be a good idea to put uh, a hamper in here, but then they wouldn't have any clean clothes because I don't have the laundry room uh, set up yet. Oopsie. Clicked other stuff. Organizer cabinet. Now that's lovely. Okay. 
That's cute. I should change it. Can I change its color? Or is it just this color? Okay, we're gonna change the color of it. Got to match the, the bathroom. And boom, we have our own little extra bathroom over here. So now, we can expand this one to make it the master bathroom. I think I need to get Ashley out of the shower before I can continue. What we're going to do is zoom out. Uh, don't. Damn it. Yeah, she came out of the shower. <laughs> that was not my intention to do that. Um, oh man, let me just... It messed everything up there. Okay, so this wall What is happening? I just I just want this wall. This one right here. Oops. Okay. So now we get a nice bigger room. Um Sorry, Ashley. I know you were in the middle of taking a shower. I think I want to keep that. Get rid of these. Okay, so as far as the flooring goes, we are going to do this one a little maybe differently. I'll go with black in here. Okay. As far as the wall goes, I might do paint. Let's see. The color. Yeah, let's do that one. Let's do that instead. Because this is the master bathroom. Oh, I forgot to cover the windows. I'll go back. I'll go back and cover the windows. Um, so let me see, for this bathroom, because I actually want to, um, get rid of these windows and have uniformity with the windows, I should say, like all the way around the house with the same windows. So... I do all the windows this way. I think I put them up too high. Yes, I did. This window. So, grab this, bring it down. Grab this, bring it down. And turn. Grab this, bring it down. Have you bring it down. Why does this room like all these windows? Wait. There. There's there. Okay. Fixed all the windows on this side of the house. It's weird looking. Okay. I got my walls, I got my windows. A lot of windows in this bathroom. Okay, now we need to upgrade the room, the master bathroom. So I really want like a nice toilet over here because this bathroom is meant to be kind of fancy. Fancy! Well, I guess I will switch the sink out. over because there's a window right here. I don't want it in front of the window. And we need a shower. 
saw a really nice shower down here. So I kind of want it where Ashley is. And then I'm going to get a really nice tub. Well, that is a hot tub. It matches that one over there. Then we need carpet. Like... It's a really big one. Well, no. We'll, we'll put it there. Yep, it has to be... I want it to be the same all over the room. So, the floor is like not super cold when you walk across it. And, um... Spare me. I kind of like it the way it is. With the weird circles on the floor. Don't, don't ask. I'm not the greatest builder. They definitely need lighting. Um, I'll grab this. Nope. I'll grab an extra light over here. Give them all the lighting in the world in this room. Now, um... I guess there are none. We need to cover... We need curtains. We need window coverings. For the bathrooms. So... Uh, let's see. Let's see. Something like this, maybe? Oh, that's that's just too big. Um... How about this? Now it's touching the floor. And I can't... Can I get it? Mmm... That's green. Okay, so get it in like a white. And we're going to cover up... Oh, okay, we can't get that window. I'm gonna cover up these. Nobody can see in the house. This window over here needs to come over a smidge so I can put the window covering in front of it. And I see there is a window covering here that no longer needs to be. And we have done it. Spent almost all of their money. We have a secondary bathroom, master bathroom, a hallway where I can attach things later if I want to, and an expanded kitchen. Let's do the roofing. Let's see. I don't think I have to do much with the roof. Not for the back of the house, but for right here, I do. For this spot right here, I gotta add a roof. Cross there. Bam. And then we're gonna lower this top part down some. There. And that we have a new roof. All right, we spent most of this kind of doing stuff, but hey, done it. We've expanded the house more. Okay, so Ashley's gonna go back to bed. I've been in the game for 24 hours. No. All right. Well. We expanded the house, and we're going to worry about Ashley aging up next time. I'll see you soon. Bye.